Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do your daily vibes for, well, the, the 7th, the 7th, December 7th, it's Friday, right? December 7th. This is for all signs, whoever it resonates with. Keep in mind, this is not a private reading. Um, some days the, these will be for you, the daily vibes, and some days they won't, okay? So, we're just going to see whatever comes up for an energy today. What do we have? Dear God, angels, spirits, and universe, what do we have? That's my take. That's what I say. Dear God, spirits, and universe, please provide the divine guidance for the people that I am about to read for today. That's, my, that's how I get my messages. Dear God, spirit and spirits and angels, thank you. Thank you. I don't know why I'm flipping. These are all upright. I'm so used to flipping. Magician in the mirror. You have the power to manifest. And probably something that you have manifested is coming coming to be the time is now something is coming that you have set out there okay some of your thoughts that you have projected to the world to the universe Are manifesting whether they're good or bad oh the yin and yang yin and yang the, the, the missing piece oh boy Anxiety. You can let go of that anxiety. It did come out reverse, but I'm going to flip it. Somebody may be fearful. About what they're going to receive. But, you know, there's really nothing to fear. Everything happens for a reason. Angels are here. 2 plus 2 equals 4. Just saying. There's definitely some anxiety. Door to value. Somebody is seeing the value. <laughs> Beyond that door. There's more to life than money. Okay, because you look beyond, beyond the door, there's, it's like the money is on this side. And through the door is the light and the flowers and the growth and the, and the beauty. The beauty is when you see beyond the materialistic things, okay? The door to value, valuing the little things, valuing the stuff that money cannot buy. So somebody is seeing the value of perhaps partnership. Because twos are about partnership. All I really want is a, my missing piece. Door to personal healing and happiness. <clears throat> but I think there's some communication issues as well because the throat chakra will mess up when there's some communication issues. So, there's definitely a new door opening. Okay, there's no doubt about it. There's a new door opening. And it's divinely guided, okay, with this magician in the mirror. There's a divinely guided new door opening. And it's a beautiful door. Because through that door, 
is light, beauty, uh, reward, healing. It's like heaven when you go through that door. I mean, doesn't that look like heaven? I mean, so we have a door that is opening because somebody is starting to see the light in regards to what really matters in life. I think that somebody has been fearful to go through this door, perhaps because of financial reasons. But now they see that, you know, that's not the answer because the answer, the, the missing piece is a, is a partnership, okay? It's a, it's the other half, you know, it's a partnership. So somebody is I, I, going through some sort of awakening, okay? We have a divine guidance here, and this is a, a seven, which is a divine guide. So this is heaven. They're, they're seeing a, a new heaven on earth. You know, heaven is in the eyes of you. You know what I mean? A partnership. It's not about money. It's not about things. It's about you. You know what I mean? It's about partnership. It's about finding that ultimate soulmate. You could call this a soulmate. Okay, you could. So I think that somebody has went through some sort of gateway, you know, to love. It's like the... The, the, the gates have been opened, the floodgates per se, you know, of, oh, this is what it's all about. This is what it's all about. It's no lie. It's about this. It's about love. So anyway, um, door to spirit. Oh my goodness. Look at the doors. All kinds of doors. Caring connection. Oh, right under this soulmate card. Okay. So I did get that right. <laughs> I usually get it right anyway. Uh, ooh, man holding heart. You know I love this man. Oh, my God. All tied up. But it's reversed, so it's getting untied. I'm going to flip it around, but it came out reversed. Somebody is getting untied after they have been stuck thinking that, you know, they had they had to have this. They had to have that. They didn't have enough to provide. They had to stay where it was unstable. They... You know, they had to put money as their main focus. No, no. Somebody is, is, is getting untied from that mentality. Oh, Jesus. I knew it was a soulmate connection. I could have told you that before I even did this reading. Oh, boy. Soulmate connection. There's. I said it, like, way up here, okay? I did. I, I knew it. So, yeah, we have a soulmate connection here. i trying not to swear. Um, yeah, and this person is going to help you to heal. This is the missing piece. So, uh, wow, wow. It's like you're the pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. Somebody is receiving some sort of reward for stepping through that doorway, listening to the divine, letting the divine guide them through that door right into a soulmate connection. Okay, so facing their fears, letting go of the need to focus on, you know, things that you can't buy love. You know, it can't buy love. So it's like, what's that song? Can't buy me love. Can't buy me love. I can't remember that song. Can't buy me love. <laughs> anyway, so anyway, some there's a new door opening that is going to be more abundant than anything money can buy. Anything money can buy. We have a, we have a, a the, the, the answer to your prayers here, okay? So there's probably going to be somebody that is breaking free from the mentality that I don't have enough to offer 
and they are coming together to unite in a soulmate connection to, you know, nurture each other and love each other and care for each other and this could even lead to marriage, whatever it is. So I feel like there's a lot, there's a divinely guided, because divi this is, this is, there's a divinely guided, um, I bet this one too, the divinely guided union that is coming into focus um, after somebody has been fearing that they didn't have enough to offer. The offer is probably being, uh, you know, brought together from the divine. You know, this person is going to face their fears. They're going to face their fears because this is... beautiful okay it's absolutely beautiful it's heaven sent so there's a heaven sent um new door opening that is full of love i mean it's it, it i i'm speechless put it that way it's gonna leave you speechless okay so yeah, we have a soulmate connection here in which somebody has been really afraid. They've been really, really afraid to, you know, open up. But now, now they see the value in in love, and they're gonna open up. They're gonna they're gonna offer their heart. So I be prepared to receive some sort of. Huh, message, you know, that says, you know. I love you. My heart is yours. You belong to me. I belong to you. You complete me. You're the one. You're the missing piece. I mean, it don't get any bigger, better than that. It does not get any better than that. I mean, I, there's not much more that I can say. I don't need to fluff it up. I don't need to add a bunch of bullshit. Somebody is facing their fears, and it looks like it's the man. I don't know. It could be. I don't know who it is about the woman. Somebody is facing their fears and opening their heart to their perfect match. And it could lead to marriage, engagement, happily ever after. This is the missing piece. It is the missing piece. You complete me. You complete me. And it is absolutely, positively, divinely guided. And these two people are going to help each other to heal whatever remnants are left of pain. Because, you know, after the rain is, or during the rain is when you get the rainbow. So, yeah. It's an absolutely beautiful, heaven-sent connection in which this is a connection that, that even money cannot buy. It's more beautiful than anything money could buy. It's heaven. We're going to get one of these just because... I might do another reading in the morning for the 7th with the Vice Versa deck. I'm just doing this one tonight, but I will do another one tomorrow. Heaven sent soulmate connection here. Fellow travelers. Support is all around you. Support is all around you. I can't cover up that man. It's just not logical. Put that over here. So, fellow travelers. Mm. Be open to support and help from others. You don't need to do it alone. Sometimes that support comes from someone you'd least expect. This could be somebody you don't expect. 
If someone offers you help, accept it. Trust that your life is guided, and this has been guided. Unseen spirit travelers are helping you. Know that you are very loved in ways that you may not always directly experience. Remember I said this was divinely guided. I knew that it was. Sharing the journey means that there is support all around you. Blessings from above are showering over your life. I knew that this was divinely guided. Remember I said angels. I never tell you guys what I say, but I did today. I did today. Interesting. Blessings from above are showering over your life. You are safe. Angels and spirit guides are real. I never have told you guys what I say before I do my readings, have I? I did today. Interesting. Angels and spirit guides are real. And their presence is near. I knew it was the I knew they were. There's they're only a thought away. They're messengers from the Creator, and they come with immense blessings and love. All is well. Remember, I told you this was angel because it's four. I'm telling you what. There's a soulmate connection here that is coming. It's meant to be. It's your missing piece. Congratulations. For those of you that see that love matters more than materialistic things. If you are still caught in your ego and money and greed are more important, then this reading is not for you. And that's a message from above. When you can see that love cannot be bought, you will receive your pot of gold. I hope this reading is for you.